Hello there guys and welcome, welcome back to the channel. So what I'm about to show you is probably my favorite path in all of Act 8.1 and one of my favorite interactions. It all has to do with this strike block node. Now there are a couple of other nodes that basically tell us that until we disable the weapon we do not want to hit opponent's block and we don't want to get carried away with parries. But the coolest thing is to do these lanes with Massacre. Now Corvus, Haltling, Valkyrie, Karnak, a bunch of other champions can do these very well. But Massacre makes it kind of like the most straightforward and definitely the individually the biggest and most fun numbers. So what we want to do here, I actually disabled that weapon slightly too early, but it's okay. That is quite all right. Now we just need to kind of rush up as much power as we can before the node is disabled and go for it. And let's look at the damage. So that's it. <laughs> that Punisher is done. No need to wait out special attacks either. 700,000 damage from that level to 713,000 total. With the biggest hit uh, out of the two being 400 plus. Now let's rinse and repeat that one. So with Massacre, this is very, very, very easy. So you want, what you want to do is parry, drop a full combo, and parry again. Now that's fine. Now, bait out a heavy attack and punish that heavy attack. Sweet. No problem there. And, uh... Since she does want to start seemingly start throwing her special attacks, that's kind of annoying, un unnecessary, but it's all good because we got slightly bigger number here. Again, level 2. 800,000 damage, biggest hit is nearly 500,000 <laughs> in the block. And again, obviously you can use other champions other than Massacre, like I brought Halfling along with me, but almost everybody of you will have Corvus, and it's pretty much the same idea, except with Corvus, you want to use level 1 in the block instead of level 2. But uh, here, uh, with Halfling, you want to build up a bit of power, I actually made a slight mistake, I should not have hit his block yet, but it's fine. So now it just starts smacking his block. Now let's get some of those Furies, which is fine. Now that Fury is gone. We might need another cycle here just because I didn't play quite perfect, but we still get nice 20k plus hits in the Warlock's block. So I don't mind it too much. And for the finish, let's just prepare again. Let's bait out the heavy attack. Punish that. I, I, I think it didn't count it. Come on. There we go. And now just drop that level 2 in the block. 74k, 87k. Very nice numbers. Very nice numbers. This time it took a whole minute to do that fight. <laughs> okay, Nick Fury. This could be a bit tricky, but let's go. So, Massacre against Nick Fury. And uh, the idea pretty much remains the same. Parry. Go for a full combo. Get some Ignite Charges. We have punished successfully the Heavy Attack now. So, what I want to do is I want to drop my... And go for level 2, and that's one life gone. And we're just gonna have to do basically the same thing again. Whoops. We made a big whoopsie here. We made two big whoopsies. Okay, now I need to bait out the heavy attack of this guy. And now I just need to find his block, and we are done. And easy peasy lemon squeezy, 300 plus k. What was the biggest hit of this fight? 323. Okay, not bad, not bad. <laughs> Let's go up against Professor X, this time use Hulkling for this one. Just to try and redeem and do this fight quicker, even though Professor X is kind of an annoying opponent, 
but this shouldn't take long at all either. So I have already disabled this, so let's just go for a full full on combo. Ah, got carried away. Thought I'm gonna go unblockable in the last hit. It's all right. And I dropped this one slightly too late. No biggie. I'm just going to push Professor X to level 2 before that falter starts. Let him use it. Get the falter off us. Punish a heavy. And now drop a special in the block. Very straightforward as well. Massacre is still by far the most fun champion to do this with though. Now Ultron and Evades. Now this could be slightly tricky. Okay. We're gonna see if Massacre can do this. I'm sure he can. Oh, except. Okay. Beware Wade. And now there we go. Unfortunately, I think he... Oh, no. He did not evade that. Sweet, sweet, sweet taste of victory for my boy. Here we go. Again, 737,000 damage. Not bad. Not bad. Do we need to finish this quest? Uh, let's see if we can bully some boss. We do have, we do have Nick Fury and uh, Quake Synergy team, so why not? Let's go in for a tiny little bully. And, uh, ooh, I know what I want to show. This is indeed one of my favorite matchups that I have mentioned before, how to deal with that war machine. So let's go for character select. And I know that this is going to be a fairly new champion that not many people have. You can use Namor and a whole bunch of other champions for this as well. But just for completely unrelated fun reasons, I hope I don't choke on this one now. It would be kind of sad if I messed myself up. Okay, so for completely unrelated fun reasons, let's see how Black Cat is doing this fight. So War Machine boss. What we want to do is... Very simple. We want to get to our level 2. <laughs> That's it. That's all we want. Okay, now that we are quite close, not bad. Because we're consistently failing all the abilities. Oh, that was some horrible crit RNG though. It's okay, those bleeds will add up and we're going to get more of them, so don't worry about that. But we definitely didn't get the best crit RNG. Look at those bleeds there. Okay, now we're good. Come on. Come on. At least we got a couple more this time. Sweet. And now all of this bleed damage is just being preserved. And we're basically just collecting bleeds on that guy. I oh, still have 19 bleeds. Our debuffs are paused. Sweet. Come on, get us some good crits here. I was actually quite unlucky with my crits here, but it is a very, very fun fight. It truly is. It was like, what, under two minutes still? You can do it probably in about a minute here with the Rank 3 Black Cat. So there we go. I do hope you guys enjoyed this 
video and showcase and uh, if you did hit that like button hit that sub button tell me which was your favorite path in act eight and i will see you guys later Hello there guys and welcome back to the channel. So we have all the information about the 